So you know, so everything gets so expensive when I want something nice for eat. So I decide to so um, go in at the supermarket, buy some shrimp, light my stove, put on my pot, and then I boil some. Gone. Yeah, put my salt, lock my pot, let that go and bubble over. I don't know, so I'm going to cook my rice. Oh, I'm going to eat white rice and brown rice. I'm going to have to work with that. Alright, now the dollar for wash our rice because the rice has to cook. Clean. Yeah, get out all of the starch out tight like the stove. Bam, put on my rice. Alright, some put in a little salt. Put in a little maggi seasoning. And no, the dollar for put in the butter. Can't let that stir, stir, stir. Yeah. Alright, now put on a pot cover and make it go and simmer. Alright, my water. Pan the stove and bubble up so I can them ready. One, two, three, four. Drop them in. Yeah, nice can bubble up. So, you know, so I throw a little lime juice pan my shrimp. Cover it down. Make it go and do its thing. Check back for my can them pot a bubble. Alright, so time to get the seasoning. Then pan the stove. So, I put some onion, my tomatoes, my pepper, my sweet pepper. And I add some of my seasoning. Then shrimp up. So, all of them in a this freezer because I don't cook every day and I don't go market every week and I don't want my seasoning them rotten. Alright. Alright, so good buddy, I just want to strip off the onion, you know, do it real quick because you don't want the onion burning in your eye and then something there. Alright, put in the seasoning them, you know, so I get ready, fake go, wash them off. So I start with my sweet pepper, green bell pepper for some people who don't know their sweet pepper in name. I cut it up, cut it up, cut it up, cut it up. Yeah, I yeah, get in the sweet pepper. I'm going to give them a little extra cup because I want them small. I'm going to come in with the onion and I go and cut up and thing. Yeah, watch me. Watch me with my sharp knife. I cut up the, 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 the onion. Yeah, you onion. Go and get cut up. And you know, say so them because Chef Ramsey can look my finger. Good finger knife. Yes, good day. All right. All right. Cut down everything because you know with your money. Yeah, down to the little bit, little tiny piece. All right, mash it up, mash it up. We are separated so we can get more. And you know we are Jamaican, so we love to get more out of our money. Drop in my onion them, along with my sweet pepper, and start preparing the rest of the thing them. But you know, some have a little piece of ginger and like that, because even though we might have used some ginger powder, we still need my ginger. So I cut up my tomato them and all them something there. Make sure so them get them nice and proper cut up. I mean, I cut up some of my tomato because some of my did spoil that at my set. I normally put my seasoning them in the freezer, so that's why you see it looks a shrivel up, shrivel up. But I watch the face, it's still good. Yeah. So, girl, I go down in our cutting up our tomato and all them something. Yeah, tomato cut up. Yeah, sharp, sharp. Yeah, you. You know about the kitchen. You know yourself. Cut up little girl, little, no, little onion and tea. No, um, I want that ginger. Yeah, she cut up the little ginger and tea because she has to get her pot nice and spicy. And she used a whole heap of tomato in. No, man, I never have to use so much tomato, but it's a little girl who like her seasoning, so you don't have to watch her face. The more seasoning, the nicer the pot. Yeah, I like that. Alright, so I move over up on the side table, light up my stove, so the seasoning them on my cut up is no joke. Put on my pot, yeah, you make sure I check for my rice over here so it look nice like it can come together. Though. So, if you want the butter stuck one place, you can serve it round and every Jamaican have to knock the side of the pot. You know that, that means the rice is nice. Alright, come back to the fried pot. I make it up a little bit, I'm going to show you a little eye. I'm going to use my banger eye. I'm going to show you the seasoning of my Yeah, and so then get a little aroma up in that. Stir, 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 stir. So them can, yeah, and cover down the pot. You yeah, don't know the dollar. Alright, I'm going to have let right as now. I'm going to have some fish seasoning. Yeah, showing that, showing that. And then I'm showing my little Caesar salt. Because you don't know, so I can't live without the Caesar salt. I like what make the pot taste even though it's not the bone. Drop in my, ba my, my little black pepper. Because, you know, we can't leave out the Negro pepper. 
Alright, I'm gonna put like a cooking seasoning. I know, but I come from here, no one has chicken, but I like to look at seasoning. I um, can't forget my maggie ginger powder, it almost done, so I try empty knock knock knock. I'm putting a little paprika, because I want a little color. Alright, so I'm gonna try out that one here. It's a spur tree curry season. I never tried it before, but I tell you, the richest side make me have to bite and I have to put in my little salt, put on my gloves, because that not get me a finger dirty with no rami. So, you know, so I get my gloves, I spin, spin, spin. Oh god, you want to smell how it smells nice and it's not even cooked yet. So, then I'm going to spin up, spin up, spin up. And ensure that all of the seasoning get inside of the meat. Yeah. All right. You don't know it now. You can't do it. You can't do it now. You have to reach in a top spin. I don't understand. I see this one. I season up the, 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 the meat real good. All right. So you don't season up to move back to the pot. Because you don't know. But did I record this part when I did mix up the, the, the coconut milk, put tip like a ketchup in it, but it looked like said apart part anybody did catch, so I saw it look. Coconut milk look good, test the rice, rice well shelly. Yeah, look for rice, girl no cook rice and rice, cook in a pot, not pot, not that pan side. Come over yes and now, and that looks so good. Mm. Drop in my mixed vegetable them now. <laughs> but just a start bubble. <laughs> Alright, you know, so you have to mix it in. I did, I did put in a little curry powder to half camera because I did forgot to put it in before the coconut milk. And I did make it go and boil a little bit with the coconut milk before I put in any of them seasoning there. Because I don't know, so they already cook. I don't know, I have a little extra beach seasoning when I make for a long time and that left. So I have to drop the little that in the pot. A little shredded carrot, some pimento seed, and I have to leak out some of the water in the inner the pot because you don't know that peppery and nice. No, I can't leave my brat. can't leave my brat. So I buy one little organic um, chicken brat. And as I said, I don't want a chicken me a cook, so they'll come for me, but I want me want my food. So I want to put whatever I want in a food one. Alright, stir, stir that. Cover that, make what, that one boil up for one next two minutes. I'll see that look from expensive, but it tell her the temperature. Catch by that. <laughs> All right, now as so I will come some ups and I try to take out the little can them out of the pot because we have to drop them in. You know, them can never really have to boil for too long because them did already cook already. A sweet can and them buy frozen rainforest in pot. You must have a car up in Paris name yes, because they can't do no, this is not a sponsorship program. Anyway, the shrimp and the can and everything else is from rainforest, so big up yourself. And them make things simpler for cook. Alright, look up at a bubble up now. Everything inside of the pot. You know it's a pot I was ready, but we were missing. We are missing the shrimp. Yes, so we are putting the shrimp them now. Look how them look seasoned. Look how them look seasoned. Yeah, yeah. And you know Jamaicans when they like for waste now. Some of the some some of the bread in the little tin pan right or so. Wash it out, wash it out. So I get my money's worth and throw that in at the pot. Bam! Yeah, season up. Empty that and make sure it's all of the water drain out. Yeah, yo. <laughs> All right, so you know, so make sure you say all of the shrimp then get a little sink in at the bottom of the pot. Right, so I'm gonna make sure you say a little something that when I put my no, pot on the spoon in there right now, them kind of over the center of the little section, and grab a little fork because them the kind of too big. So, I get a fork to sink them to make them put them in at the pot bottom. Because we don't want no shrimp when I cook. You don't know, no, so it not take that long to cook, but orange will start kicking and when the orange start kicking and yeah well I turn our pot because I'm gonna want to hook on the side that's a load. I catch the fire and I don't know say the place is so big so yeah we have to make work with what we have make usage of what we have so you know say my still a stir why you can't see very soft still a stir actually my god and yeah she has stuck up my, my, my mama knows so she wanna get in all of the flavor in her pot so look how food look fuck bad yeah coconut curry shrimp you know even though pepper in the pot I have to put in my scotch bonnet pepper I'm gonna ask Christ yes yeah, scotch bonnet I have to go down a little more salt I have to go in the pot 
And we are Jamaican, so we don't really use measurement. But look how the food look good. Me and me, my little bit that you know, so I don't eat much. And I tell you, even if like more food is in the plate, I would have never thought because that looks so delicious. Yeah, so delicious. I look how my food can in a big plate now. I look on my plate. You know, so I wonder why my plate looks so empty. I mean, well, start them to, you know. Look there. You can tell by the look of my face and so the food tastes good. Where restaurant of Maui? Nothing. I have to take an expose for the camera. I'm not telling no lie. I mean, love no lie to me on the other seats. But the time I need to have to get up because I'm not telling you why the food got on the right place. So, I have to go to one next more sweet on camera. But I have to come on the other side. I have to go down. It's a waste my time. Oh, God. It's so good. I wish you could have get some for this, but I'm telling you, no lie. Yeah, food is good. Food is good. Yes, see I just remember my car and go back and put it in my plate. And what them feel like? I wonder how my plate feels so empty. And you know, some me could have never eat shrimp. And my cat and I am done. Lex, you big up yourself. Right? You big up your damn self and you can food done, you know. But you know, me Jamaican people love to get the little out of our money. So I'm not stop them this account here and take no more juice now if you like suck me and suck it out. It's the worst of all, I still have my teeth in my mouth and the false teeth is so I'm going to use it. Yeah, my account here. Alright, so see there. Rice cream now, plate left. Some, some food left. Too rotted. She never had no life food and left them little rice grain there. And I bada feel like saying, you know, see them little rice grain there. And look at sitting left in the plate, so I never did clean it out. I clean it out. I go back. And the one you have to do is you know. If you know, you know. If you don't know, yeah.